Welcome. In this video, you are going to learn how to convert a Word file into a PDF. There are different ways to do that, but we will show you the quickest way in this video. Let's do this. Hello, my name is Mark and you are watching the Office Master tutorial. Office Master is here to help you learn how to use Microsoft Office in quick and simple step-by-step -step tutorials. First, you should navigate to the File menu in the top right corner. Click on File and then select the Export option. When you finish with that, click on the button Create PDF slash XPS. You'll get asked where you want to save the PDF file you're about to create in the pop-up dialog box. Choose a specific folder or other location on your computer. We are going to save it on the desktop and change the file name if needed. Now, let's have a quick look at the advanced settings you can use when creating a PDF. Select the box Open File after publishing if you want to open the PDF automatically after saving. This option comes in handy when you check for any typing errors or if your document was exported correctly. The other two options, which you can see in the dialog box, stand for document size. If you want to save your PDF in high quality, choose the option Standard. If you want to keep the file size to a minimum, choose Minimum Size. We will select Standard and continue along. When you click on the Options button below, you can set additional options. For illustration, you can choose which pages of the document you want to export as PDF, either all of them, Current Page, or Selected Pages from your Word document. If the box Document Properties is checked, the created PDF will maintain the properties of the source Word file. If the Documents Structure Tags for Accessibility box is checked, that means the PDF file will make it easier for screen reading software to read and navigate the document. Moreover, the option PDF A will help you archive documents compliant with ISO standards. Besides, it's good to know that you can choose the box Optimize for image quality if high-definition images are inside your Word document. This option will stop Word compressing those images into a lower-resolution PDF format. You should use this option if you are creating a print-ready PDF. Once you pass through all the options and selected the ones you need, click on the OK button and then Publish, and we are done. Now you can see your PDF file. If you found this tutorial helpful, reward us with a like. Is this your first time on our YouTube channel? We would be more than grateful to welcome you to our community, so hit the subscribe button to enjoy more of our videos and learn how to master Word. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.